We're starting this hour with some breaking news. The U.S. Marshal Service is leading another manhunt right now. Two inmates escaped a Philadelphia prison with no one even noticing they were gone. One of them, an 18-year-old, accused of killing four people. News Nation's Evan Lambert joins us now live. And Evan, it took nearly 19 hours before anyone noticed they were missing. So how does this happen? Yeah, a lot of people are going to be asking that question. Kelly, just an incredible amount of time for no one to notice that the two inmates were missing. A U.S. Marshal source tells me they should be considered armed and dangerous. Federal officials taking over the manhunt just this afternoon. They're looking for accused murderer, 18-year-old Amin Hurst and 24-year-old Nasir Grant. Prison officials say the two inmates escaped from a fenced-in outdoor area on Sunday night, but no one noticed until Monday afternoon. Prison officials acknowledge that the yard area where these two are accused of cutting through a fence should have been secured. And then the other big thing here, there were three inmate counts before anyone noticed the inmates were gone. Hearst is accused of four murders, including shooting and killing someone on Christmas Eve 2020. He's a very dangerous individual from what we know, and we are looking for the public's help to get him back. I'm really angry about it. There's no reason for this. Uh, and if everybody followed through and do what they're supposed to do, we wouldn't have this problem. So we're going to find out what happened, who didn't do what, and get to the bottom of it, and then we'll, we'll deal with the fallout from it. And the embarrassment for the Philly Department of Prisons comes as just last week, the prison workers union voted unanimously that they had no confidence in the commissioner. This amid a severe staffing shortage. Kelly, it's not clear what role that may have played in the escape. Incredible. So, Evan, what protocols are in place to make sure all inmates are accounted for? Yeah, so I mentioned those three counts. The commissioner of the Department of Prisons says there were checks at 11 on Sunday night, 3 and 7 on Monday morning, and all three did not pick up on the fact that these two inmates were missing. Astounding. All right, Evan, thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.